And all right, let's go with the next one here, Mr. Davenport. Yes, sir. Thank you. Uh, this next case, rezoning 2017-08, is for rezoning of a piece of property in the West Ridge Business Park. The proposed use is not currently allowed in CG zoning, which is the current zoning. And so the applicant is requesting to rezone that to highway commercial to allow for really the classification as a potential warehouse use. And so with that, staff looked at the request. We don't have any updates for you uh, tonight. Um, but ultimately, we, our recommendation was for approval without any conditions. Any questions of staff from the commissioners? Being none, I will open it up. Anyone here in, in wanting to speak in favor of this request, please come forward, state your name and address for the record. for the presenter from the commission and staff. Anyone else is, wants to speak in favor of this request? Seeing none, we'll go to uh, anyone who wishes to speak in denial of this request. Anyone to speak in denial of this request? Seeing none, we'll turn it over to the commissioners for any discussion or possible voting. I have a, I yes. have a question actually for staff. Uh, Jason, the property is, I mean, we understand that directly to the east of the subject property, it's a residential. Mm -hmm. And I know that it's sort of a triangulated property. And there is, uh, I don't know if that's flattened or it seems like a wet area yes, in the back. Um, those six properties that are facing Hammer Lane, currently they are CG. And some of those, are these businesses that are across the street from Hammer Lane? Or I guess I'm trying to see why is it so for a warehouse use, we have to go from CG to the highway, commercial highway. Yes, ma'am. It's just one of those uses that because, I think, because of the outdoor storage kicked into a highway commercial, outdoor storage typically is not allowed in the general commercial, and sometimes with a warehouse use, you have an outdoor storage component with that. And so I agree. It actually caused some conversations on staff's end to be like, okay, well, Maybe there are certain operations without the outdoor storage that are appropriate, which this one is one of those where it's an indoor, dominantly indoor warehouse use. But right now, all I can tell you is I think it's related to the outdoor storage. Normally with outdoor storage, you kick into a higher highway commercial zoning classification. So are there any of the uses under um, CH that need to be limited, considering where this is located and the fact that it's mm -hmm. going to sit across from residential area. I, I looked through the use chart with that in mind because I understand where you're going with that. There were probably, I'll say, maybe three that caught my attention. Um, one was a kennel with an outdoor run, mm -hmm. animal hospital vet clinic, a lounge bar nightclub, or research and experimental laboratory. And you know there's a whole host that are allowed. But at the end of the day, did I feel like those were worth putting a condition on restricting their use? I did not. But those were the ones I would candidly tell you that kind of caught my eye that made me pause to think, do we need a condition on there? Knowing the developers and their plans, um, I didn't think so. The only real CG lot that I had high concern about was the one to the north here because it does back up to an existing residence. But I felt like there was an existing buffer there, um, especially to the east, that would be appropriate. Those were the four uses that, that got my attention. I don't think they're likely, but they're allowed per the use chart. They may not be likely with the current developer, right. but that doesn't mean they may not. That is true. That's true. But I did. I considered that. But ultimately, do you find it strong enough to put a condition on there? I did not. But that's my opinion. Okay. Thank you. 
Any other questions or staff? Okay. Um, request the uh, 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 motion. Chairman, <coughs> I recommend that we follow staff's approval and approve or follow staff's recommendation and approve this. Very good. Okay. Very good. Thank you, sir. Mr. McClendon? Mr. McClendon, yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. All right. We'll put it to a vote. All in favor of recommending approval, please raise your right hand. It's unanimous, Mr. Cobell. All wishing to deny, please do so by raising your right hand. All right. Thank you very much. And now we move on.